All right, we got our very first data download for the worldwide celebration, which tells us the official start time for the celebration, which is on the 25th of August. We have the information for the SSR trunks. It looks like he's going to be one of those celebration characters where he will awaken in part two. And then he will EZA in part three or whatever, just like the anniversary units. And of course, with this data download, there's heaps of more information to go through. So strap in, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Let's get into the details. So let's start off with the free-to-play SSR Trunks here. He's a future saga lead for two key and 30% stat boost. Raises defense on super. We're already starting off good. Key plus one, attack defense 70% up. And attack and defense 10% with each attack performed up to 50%. That is very nice. Attack and defense 30% with when performing a super attack. When there is a future saga category ally attacking in the same turn. He's got the nice cold judgment link. Z fighters, messenger of the future, dismal future, soul versus soul. So that's an android cell saga link and royal lineage. And I can see from his stats, his base max and he's 100%. There's only like a 3000 difference, which means he's not going to be an LR. And he is confirmed to probably EZA. So he's probably only at best going to be a 77% Future Saga leader. But if they do him correctly, he should be still very nice. Because at this point, all they need to do really is increase his numbers. And he would be pretty solid. So we have the Worldwide Celebration trailer as well. So let's have a quick glance at this. This is what you will see once you log in. I think when the uh, celebration begins. This is only the JP version. The global has not gotten a data download yet, but obviously it will just be translated to English. Is that a new OST? All right, we have um, some old animations from like LRs. We're starting it off with the uh, Zamasu arc. There he is. Beautiful. Oh, this is new. So this is going to be the Blue Vegito's transformation. <laughs> Let's go! Oh my god, it looks sick! Oh, I cannot wait to officially see the full animation on the live stream. Uh, this will be the wallpaper for the Worldwide Celebration. I think you'll probably unlock this as well for your home screen. And we also have some other news where they have leaked the Stage 3 of the Ultimate Red Zone for the Dismal Future. We are versing Goku Black here. Um, I'm assuming it goes at max Zamasu, then Goku Black, then Rosé. Minimum, I'd say base form to Rosé. So it's at least prepare for like a 2-3 to three phase um, battle. And then we have a new story event, which is where you're going to be farming the int trunks that we saw earlier. And um, obviously, more stages will continue to unlock to get the medals and stuff, and stuff like that. And this future saga event that is already out will have a stage 8 included. It doesn't show us what we will potentially grab from stage 8. Could be a support memory, could be awakening medals for the pre-existing future team trunks, the STR one, because he needs to awaken an EZA. But because we didn't see in the data download, it's probably not going to happen. Uh, then we have a new challenge event, just like the last Worldwide Celebration, a new high difficulty event, Divine Wrath and Mortal Will will be coming, and you'll be getting this support memory. Details on the support memory is not yet been found out, maybe in this data download. We'll have a scene a bit. But there is a unique title to grab as well. Formidable foes will activate various skills to stand your way. Prepare for the upcoming clashes against them. It sounds different to what we had last time with the cooler, with the cooler movie stuff where you had to use characters from that specific movie to do extra damage or tank better. Not sure if that's going to be the same thing here. And of course, we're going to get a Virtual Dokken Ultimate Clash Worldwide Campaign Edition. And it looks like the final stage is going to be Sword Hope Trunks which is pretty cool. It will be three levels, so no fourth stage, unfortunately. There's actually some more upcoming missions as well. Uh, we have from the LG GT all the way to the Red Ribbon Androids. So let's quickly give this a translate. So we have for the GT, we have Future Saga. And then it looks like Realm of Gods here for the uh, GT Goku. For the Vegeta, we have Future Saga. And I guess again, Realm of Gods. Um, and then we have for the Wicked Bloodline, uh, stage 5, which I believe is the cooler core. And it's recovery power. I don't know what that one is. It could be powerful comeback. Nothing rings a bell for me. 
And then also Conquest of Terror, Terrifying Conquerors. That one should be pretty easy. I don't know what this category is. If it's powerful comeback, I'm so screwed. <laughs> um, then we have for the Red Ribbon Army one, uh, we have Stage 6, which is the um, Cell Max. And it looks like you have to use a Super Team, like, like a Super Rainbow Team. And this one, I think, is the extreme version of that. And this is the Dismal Future Red Zone, where if you complete Stage 3, you'll get another 7 of the tickets, as well as 5 Dragon Stones. Here are the three special stones that you'll be able to get. The red one's obviously for free. It looks like we... This one's a new one, which is the LR Premium Dragon Stone. Obviously, it's going to cost you money, but that will allow you to purchase an LR. And there seems to be more tickets up for grabs for more summons, which is good. Uh, I believe the 50 is the uh, massive multi-summon, obviously. And then this is like the thank you one. I don't remember. <laughs> but that's pretty much it for the day to download. They're obviously still hiding... The headlining units, obviously, um, that will be a surprise for us for the live stream. Hopefully, they don't screw up the data download and release it before then and spoil us too quickly. I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel with the notification bell on. I'll see you guys in the next video.